Now let us look at the question number 10 here and this is again one of the easiest question because they are directly asking about the time complexity or the, or the space complexity. They are saying consider the following terminologies and the match the list 1 and list 2 and choose the correct answer from the code given below. So B represents the branching factor, D is the depth of the shallowest solution, M is the maximum depth of the search tree and L or you can say this L is representing the depth limit. So generally for example this is representing a tree. Now you can see this is a ternary tree. Right? So in this tree if you see what is the branching factor here, branching factor is 3. Why? Because every node is having 3 children and the depth of the shallowest solution. So what is the shallowest solution or you can say shallowest node here. So you can see from here I can go till here. So this is the depth of the shallowest solution. And this is also the maximum depth of the search tree here in this case. But again uh, in some different graph this and this they can be different. Uh, we have to draw a different graph for this and then we have the depth limit. So what is the depth limit? So maximum how much depth you are allowed to take. Now here they are giving an algorithm which is BFS, DFS, depth limited search and iterative deepening and they are asking what is the space complexity for all of them. And it's a very straightforward question if you have studied some of I I these algorithms then you should know what is uh, the space complexity. So in case of breadth first search, the space complexity of breadth first search is order of V that is the number of vertices and which can also be written as order of B raised to power D because in case of breadth first search you uh, traverse according to the breadth and you take a Q here in this case and you take all the adjacent vertices in the Q. Now again then we have uh, the next one is your depth first search. In case of depth first search, if I just give in terms of vertices, then it is order of V, right? So V is the number of vertices, but again, uh, this is also representing the longest path. So longest path from uh, root to node, for example, here, this is the tree. Now here, the longest path is like this, right? So here, the depth is order of V. But if we just give in terms of uh, B, there is a branching factor E, there is a depth. So the time complexity here is order of B into D. So there's a basic difference between DFS and BFS here, which is uh, according to the space complexity of uh, these two operations, these two algorithms, totally depends on how these algorithms are working. So in case of DFS, it is B into D. But then when we come about this iterative deepening, iterative deepening, in this case, uh, it is order of D only. So out of these four we know for three therefore we will be able to solve it right. So here for breadth first search BFS the correct answer is uh, B raised to power D that is 2 and for DFS the correct answer is 1. So f let us check how many options can we eliminate. So we can eliminate uh, the option number 1 here because here this is wrong. Then in option number 2 uh, we have uh, 1 and both of them are giving correct right for a they are giving one so this is wrong so let us look at the other options here then we have in option number three they are giving for option number a we have two correct for option number b we have three so for option number b we have option number three actually this is uh, uh, for the cell shallow solution and uh, okay so again this option number 3 and 4 we have we can check for option number 3 uh, a is 2 that is correct and for b is 3 so for b we are getting 3 that is also okay because here m is representing the maximum depth of the search tree so here uh, when i was i have written this so here d was representing the maximum depth of the search tree because we go till the maximum depth therefore i can say I can just correct it up here. So if I just correct it up for option number B, I can also write uh, this one fine. And then we have iterative deepening. Iterative deepening is order of D where D is representing uh, the depth that is the maximum depth, right? So here uh, uh, this and this depth limited search is means that we are going to go till a certain depth only and uh, then for option number C I think the correct answer should be 
ऑप्शन नंबर फोर एंड ऑप्शन नंबर डी द करेक्ट आंसर शुड बी दिस वन ओके सो दिस इज द करेक्ट आंसर सो इफ यू जस्ट मैच द ऑप्शन सो वन एंड टू दे आर रॉन्ग ऑप्शन नंबर फोर इज ऑल्सो रॉन्ग बिकॉज फॉर ए द करेक्ट आंसर इज टू एंड द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन नंबर थ्री हियर दैट इज द करेक्ट आंसर सो फॉर दिस क्वेश्चन नंबर टेन द करेक्ट करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन नंबर सी आई होप यू कॉट इट बिकॉज दिस इज वेरी स्ट्रेट फॉरवर्ड क्वेश्चन बिकॉज यू शुड नो द टाइम कॉम्प्लेक्सिटी ऑफ दिस सॉल्यूशंस